Hi guys, it's Melanie Excuse. This will come. It's 11.30 now. It's been raining since I got out of the movies. And I saw Resident Evil, if you all were curious. It was alright. I don't really think it was worth the money. But, whatever. I do have a little haul to show you. Nothing major. Um, didn't really think this through. But I did get another sinful color nail polish and the let's talk number 929 it's a really pretty purple color I know the lighting isn't the best for it but just a really deep fall purple and then I got this Alme clear complex um, clear complex concealer and the shade 100 light I'm hoping it's gonna be the right color if not I'll just return it then I got Remember how I got the Evil Queen palette? Well, I also got the other ones. Um, it's Elf Face Lip, uh, Eyes, Lips, Face, Evil Everyday Eyes, a makeup look for the makeup book for the villainous beauty in you and Coella from the Disney movie. And it does have a little mirror there, but I'm gonna cover it so you guys don't get that like, weird glare I had in the last time I showed you. And it has fake eyelashes, the glue, the daytime colors, primer, lip cheek colors, um, liquid eyeliner, and a uh, lip cheek color. Now, starting from this way, you got Puppy Love, then you got Code of Dreams, then Cruelty, then Swage, or Sewage, then down here you got Spotted, Manic. Little Beast in Exhilaration, I believe it's called. And then over here, you got the little Koala her with her black hair side. And then her with the whitey silver hair side. And then at the end, I'll go through the Evil Queen because I didn't actually name the colors. Then this is the Sinister Smoky Eyes from the Sleeping Beauty um, Evil Witch. I think her name is Malnificent. I don't really know how to pronounce her name. It's kind of like Magnificent, but with M-A-L-E. So I want to say Malnificent. So, yeah. And then, once again, the little mirror. And then you get the fake eyelashes and the daytime colors, primer, lip pencil, nighttime. And then you got a glittery eyeliner. Or liquid eyeliner, and then the night, uh, the nighttime lip colors, and then over here you got spindle, uh, script or something like that, fog of doom, Fiona, the misfortune, forest of thorns, deep sleep, and Diablo. And I'm trying to like hit the light. So you guys can see, I'm sorry about the massive glare you guys are getting. And that's that one. And these were each $9.99 at Walgreens. And then I'll go through the Evil Queen colors. And this is the Devilishly Dramatic Eyes. And she also has the thick eyelashes. I'll actually go back through and zoom in on the thick eyelashes so you all can see them. Then you got the top daytime colors, which are One Bite Vanity. Make sure the glare isn't getting you guys. Um, narciss narcissistic, then potions, then fairies of the land, majesty, peddler's cloak, and poisoned apple. And then the same colors are liquid eyeliner things. Maybe if I would have like, and then that little still protective look, like, little sheet thing that stays in there, so that way you. Don't get anything landing in your eyeshadows because they don't have any other protective thing other than this little thing. And here I'll zoom in on the false eyelashes. I don't really wear false eyelashes unless I feel like it's going to be a special occasion. If anybody knows how long false eyelashes are like good for after you wear them, like can you re-wear them? Because I've never actually used them before. Lord, that cat just scared me. And there's... This one's Malnificent one. I really like hers. Very dramatic and full for hers. The Evil Queen's 
and it's very like hers is very like spaced out with like a few sticking out to make it look kind of full but not really full but this one makes it look really full and then koala is supposed to be like a daytime look kind of thing so hers are like natural kind of lashes if you guys can see that um Basically, Quell is supposed to be like the everyday, morning, night, like nothing really dramatic unless you make it dramatic kind of thing. Um, these are supposed to be uh, smoky eyes. Hers are the smoky eyes. And then these are the dramatic ones. And I did get an orange nail polish, but you guys probably have seen that already. And the nail color I have on right now is, well you can't see it, but it was, it is Spanish Moss. And so, I got these three. I don't think they have any others out, because these are like the main villains they've always talked about that everybody references to. With, you know, the evil witch from... Sleeping Beauty, then you got Koala, which everybody knows who Koala is from 101 Dalmatians and 101 Dalmatians 2, and then all that. For both the live action movies and the cartoon movies. And then Dalmatians also had their own cartoon series, and she was in there. And then since the new Snow White movie came out, Snow White and the Huntsman, you got the Evil Queen. I also got the book, uh, it's way over there, but I got the Snow White and the Huntsman book. And so far, they only have these three out. I don't know if they'd ever have any more, because the one from Beauty and the Beast was a guy as the villain, and then the villagers, so I don't think Gaston would have his own eyeshadow book. Um, they may create one for the Disney princesses, or they may already have. I don't know. If anybody knows that, just leave a comment down below and let me know. I know this video was, like, super long, but I kind of, um, but my lady is the best, and I wanted to show you all this now. And if you guys would like a closer look, just let me know, and I'll be more than happy to do a video with, like, the one specific one of showing you everything in it. Oh, and hers also had the little thing in it, describing, you know, how to use it. If anybody would like to see any tutorials on this, let me know in the comments below. And then I'll show you the Evil Queens as well. But if anybody knows if the princess has ones, or if there's any others outside of these three, because Walgreens only had these three, and it was like a three-thing shelf, or display. So, and I don't know if any other Disney villains outside of these ones, Gaston, um, I don't think that Cinderella's, um, Wicked Stepmother or Stepsisters would have their own, cause these ones are more like considered glamorous evil people than the wicked stepsisters and stepmother. Uh, I don't think Ursula would have her own. She may though. I could see her having like a, like a lot of purple and like black palette one. I could see that. Or the her sister from Little Mermaid too might have one. But I would see Ursula as having more, because I don't think... Because I know Little Mermaid is far more popular than the other one. Well, I'm going to go. Please comment, rate, subscribe, leave a comment down below if you'd like to see any tutorials. What your thoughts and feelings were on these three, or if you know if there's more than just these three. Alright, well, these were all made by Elf. I don't know if you guys can get them online. But, yeah. Thanks, guys. Have a good one.